The High Court was filled with party members who were present to witness Justice Stephen Musota deliver the ruling on the UPC leadership row. Betty Mongi and Fred Abil had filed a case against UPC President Olaro Tuno for making preparations to convene a delegates conference as per the party's roadmap to 2016. The conference is scheduled for the 10th June 2015. The applicants also argued that Tutuno's presidential term had expired in March, but he was still in office. Justice Stephen Musota ruled that Otuno's term in office is still valid until the delegates' conference is convened and a new president is elected. Even if the court order was there, it would not prevent. Now the court simply said, you want me or you want court to order the party to call for delegates' conference. It has already done so. The applicants had also held that there was a court injunction halting any party activities tagged to 2016 until a petition before the court is heard and decided. The court injunction they are talking of expired in February, February this year. That was its lifetime. Even if it did not expire, it did not prevent the, the party from going on. We don't understand. There is a court order subsisting saying UPC should not do any activities. Then the court now says uh, what they did with the court order in subsistence prohibiting them to do it is okay, there is a roadmap. A roadmap done by one man. The applicants have said they will appeal the court's decision. And today we shall file the appeal. To say that they are going to appeal is to actually play drama in court. Katemba Mukote. This is what they are, uh, they are putting forward. More research all in T.